natural disasters nature sustains life on earth but it is also one of the biggest causes of destruction natural disasters are extreme forces of nature that result in death and destruction of people and property some forms of natural disasters are floods droughts earthquake cyclone volcanic eruptions tsunami etc floods when water level in a water body or any area rises above normal it leads to a condition called floods flood water often kills several people and animals many water borne diseases can spread in times of flood causes of flood floods are also caused by the collapse of dams blocking of rivers due to landslides cyclones and tsunamis in coastal areas typhoons with strong tides or storms in the sea sudden melting of large amounts of snow on mountains during the summer season tsunamis tsunami is a japanese word which means harbor waves Tsunamis are sudden, unexpected and very large ocean waves that can cause sudden movement of water. They are also known as undersea earthquakes. Earthquakes. Sometimes there are sudden movements under the surface of the earth. These cause strong vibration or tremors on the surface of the earth. These tremors are known as earthquakes. Generally earthquakes are caused when the rocks break suddenly. More and more earthquakes are happening due to human development and constructional activities. Earthquakes cause a lot of destruction to buildings and construction and several lives get lost under the debris. Seismograph The seismograph is an instrument that is used to record earthquake tremors. Richter scale The magnitude or intensity of an earthquake is measured on the Richter scale. Seismology The scientific study of earthquakes is called seismology. Focus. The place of origin of an earthquake is called the focus. Epicenter. The point directly above the focus on the earth's surface is called epicenter. Volcanic eruptions. A volcano is an opening of the earth's crust through which molten rock, magma, comes up on the earth's surface due to excessive heat and chemicals released during a volcanic eruption a lot of mass destruction takes place people living even far away from the volcano get affected by the heat and ash that comes out landslides the movement of rock debris or earth down a slope is called landslide urbanization and deforestation can weaken a mountain and start a landslide Landslides can result in either a single rock fall or even toppling down a mountain or hill. Cyclones. Cyclones are violent storms. They form over oceans and seas and cause destruction when they reach the shore. Cyclones are always accompanied by heavy showers and high speed winds. Forest fires. The burning of forest like a wild fire is called a forest fire. Forest fires occur in many places around the world where there is plenty of wood, dried leaves and forest cover that can burn themselves due to excessive heat of the sun. Now let's recall. Natural disasters are extreme forces of nature that result in death and destruction of lives of people and property. Cyclones, floods, droughts, forest fires, landslides, tsunami, earthquakes and volcanic eruptions are some commonly occurring natural disasters. Tsunamis are sudden, unexpected and very large ocean waves that can cause sudden movement of water. Earthquakes cause a lot of destruction to buildings and constructions and several lives get lost under the debris. Due to excessive heat and chemicals released during volcanic eruption, a lot of mass destruction takes place. Forest fires occur in many places around the world where there is plenty of wood, dried leaves and forest cover that can burn themselves due to excessive heat of the sun. Thank you.